What was believed to be just a sore neck for an enterprise fourth grader, masked in illness, friends, it is far more serious. It was a diagnosis of T cell lymphoblastic lymphoma, a rare and fast growing cancer. And now a community is coming together tonight to show their support. Our Tiffany McGrath brings us Jalen's journey. Had that much straight. <laughs> One morning in June, nine year old Jalen Bernice woke up with a pain in his neck. Jalen's family figured he had just slept on it wrong. That was the first time I. Had neck pain. We let a couple of days go by and it never got better. Then one day, Jalen was at school. My mom, she called me and she said, Hey, you know, Jalen needs to go see his doctor. His neck is swollen. Jalen's pediatrician referred him to the hospital where an ultrasound was conducted, revealing several swollen lymph nodes. He was prescribed antibiotics and the swollen lymph nodes went down. Then, the last day of taking his antibiotics, they came back. Jalen's doctor then removed a lymph node and performed a biopsy. That's when it came back showing that he had um, lymphoma cancer. At that moment, I wanted to break down and cry. Uh, he looked at me, he was like, Mom, what is that? And I said, oh, it's nothing. I want people to go through the stuff I'm going through right now. Jalen has already begun chemo treatments. He and his mother drive to Children's Hospital in Birmingham every Friday. Jalen has received get well baskets, donations, and a visit from Enterprise High School football coaches and players. The family's church, Hardy's and Enterprise, the Red Elephant and Dothan, and other area businesses have showed their support. I want my brother to get better. I'm so proud of him, and he's a straight-A student. This is just a the thing that we're going through, we're going to push through and we're going to make it through this. Keeping it local on Enterprise, Tiffany McGrath, WDHN News 18. And all of us here at News 18 want Jalen to get well as, as well in the process. Jalen's remission could take up to two to three years. If you'd like to know more about Jalen's journey, visit our website, dothanfirst.com.